The resident DJ for the San Francisco Giants has been infusing Oracle Park with added energy and excitement since 2021. And she's also a very proud Filipina American. DJ Umami says she has overcome a number of challenges and has hope for future generations. KTVU's Amber Lee joins us now live in studio after hearing from the DJ. Amber. Julie, Mike, she tells me she never imagined that she would have this great career. She says she realizes that being a Filipina American DJ puts her in a position where she can make a difference to young people. Iana Cruz's stage name, DJ Umami, brings flavor, excitement, and energy to Oracle Park, the home of the Giants. A lot of times I, have, I feel like I need to pinch myself because I'm like, what? how did we get here? Cruz works right on the field for pregame shows and batting practice at the request of players. But she says her journey as a female DJ in what has been primarily a male-dominated industry was difficult. It was definitely a struggle. There were like some DJs that I looked up to that made it hard for me to be in the same spaces as them. Fans say they're excited to see crews behind the turntables. Usually DJs are guys, so see as a girl's cool, fun, good representation here in baseball. Cruz has proven herself with hard work and perseverance during 15 years of performing. The music is always like, like the number one thing that heals you. Cruz says she was in tech sales when she started DJing at clubs. Then in 2012, she started working for the Golden State Warriors during select games and special events. Cruz tells me a proud and spontaneous moment came when she saw Oakland rapper Too Short in her audience and invited him to join her. Cruz tells me she loves what she does. Cruz performed at Bottle Rock this past weekend. She says her strength comes in part from being a single mom to two boys. She credits her mother and stepfather for helping her raise them. Cruz is also a proud first-generation Filipina American, the child of parents who immigrated from the Philippines. It is an important story to tell because there's not a lot of us, and I'm part of that representation that matters to these young Filipino women um, and other young Asian Americans. Even as a child seen here singing with mom, music has always been part of her life. And there were early signs she was meant to be a DJ. Her advice to young people? Be on time, be nice, stay humble. Cruz tells me she's savoring every moment of a career she never expected to have. She plans on doing this for years to come. Uh, she better. I mean, to go from tech sales <laughs> to this, I think it's fantastic. <laughs> and she grew up here, right, in the yes. Bay Area? East San Jose. East San Jose. And she now she lives in Oakland. And she looks great. like she's having a lot of fun. Amber, thank you. Thanks, Amber.